Sanmonani Dumelang Sin Chao. My name is Judicious Masugu and welcome to Navigating the Streets of Life with Judy. On this channel, we believe that everyone is out there navigating their own way uh, in the streets of life. It's either we are navigating our health, we are navigating our finances, relationships, and careers. We are just in the streets of life navigating uh, our way. I would like to just to briefly give I would like to give a briefly a brief description <laughs> I would like to give a brief description about myself so this is Judy Judicious Masuku I'm a lover of words I'm a lover of color I'm a lover of line I'm a lover of shades I'm a lover of art, drawing, sketches, painting. Uh, art and literature for me is, is, there's a mystery in there, you know, and it, it, it is this element that is full of meaning, elaboration, uh, I feel like art is an extension of who we are. It allows us to fully express ourselves without the limitation on the construct of how a message should be sent, how a, 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 a this and this should be done. But art allows you to be liberated. It just allows you to flow in your thoughts, in your emotions, in your feels, you know. So I am a lover of art. I love art and literature. I feel like there's a deep meaning uh, that we find in art, be it uh, sketches, drawings, paintings, decor, uh, literature and with that being said I would I'd like to share a piece uh, just a passage to read a passage from the book I am currently reading the book I am currently reading is journey confidential so I just want to read this passage for you. I am not going to analyze it. I'm not going to comment on them. It is open for analysis. It is open for commentary. It is open for discussion. If you are willing to. Uh, you can just leave a comment on the comment uh, down below. So now, down below. <laughs> what English is that? Down below. Isn't below down? Down below? Below down? But anyways, it goes like this. When we tell a story, we exercise a kind of control over our lives. There will be spaces in our stories and on some level, we hope that the spaces and silences will be intuited by someone else. Someone once said, we are the stories we tell. We construct personal narratives and we spend our lives working and reworking them. Our memories may be unreliable. We fabricate, embellish, and embroider. We cross-stitch and unpick. We weave a tapestry self, and it is through this tapestry self that we construct a unified whole out of the many strands, skeins, ribbons, and clothes that contribute to our sense of self. DNA can be sequenced. 
brains can be scanned, batteries of personality tests can be run, but you won't find the essence of someone in any of them. It's the stories they tell that will provide the interpretative layer. I find this passage to be so rich in meaning. There are many um, poetic language that is used in this passage, such as imagery, uh, simile, metaphor, and yeah, there are a lot of imageries in this passage. I hope you analyze it. You find meaning in it, but I love uh, the art and poetic language used in writing this passage. I hope you enjoyed this video and please like. You can share it with people who love reading, people who love art and literature, who love poem. I'm for myself i love poems i i enjoy reading good poem short but deep in meaning so yeah take care thank you